Bloody hell, my computer won't boot today. Turned it on, got a loop of a uh, bias screen and not much else. Let's see what the problem is. So today I fire up my computer. This is my uh, plasma monitor. And it's not going to start, it's going to just freeze right here and not do anything. And that's all it's doing is it's just sitting there doing that over and over again. And then eventually it just goes to that and it won't do anything any further than that. I'll power it down and nothing's going to happen. It's just going to do the same thing repeatedly. And I, I couldn't figure out what the problem was I tried restarting this thing about a dozen times and I finally figured out what the fault is. It's caused by a peripheral. My uh, capture card, my HD capture card is locking out the system and it's just it's not going to do anything. It's just going to sit here and do this repeatedly and then it'll eventually come up with that blue screen of death. So the first thing I suspect is this HD PVR. This is a Hophodge HD PVR that I use to capture analog uh, component signals. And I suspect that maybe this is causing the problem because it won't turn on. So I suspect that probably this brick is causing a problem. So let's just unplug the brick and we'll try rebooting the computer and see whether the computer will boot. I'm going to reach out and smack that person. You know, how many times you tell people when you're doing something and they start messaging you and you say, I'm busy, and you think that, that would be done, that they'd be done, but no. They just keep sending me messages. It drives me absolutely crazy. So once again, I'll tr try turning the computer on and we'll see whether Windows will start up this time now that I've removed this brick. This is just a 5 volt 5.1 volt 2 amp power supply that powers this thing up and when I give it the sniff test it fails miserably it smells like something in here is burning up okay let's see whether this thing is going to boot ah starting windows so my secondary monitor should come online now this is to say this one is my uh, this is my editing monitor, so my secondary monitor, which sits beside it, has now just sprung to life. And it's going to ask me to log in to my desktop. So let's see whether I can log in. Wait for the keyboard to light up here. And there my desktop is back and my secondary desktop on my edit monitor is back. So, what have we learned today? If your computer's not booting, check those bloody wall warts that power your accessories such as capture cards and USB hard drives and the likes because it looks like, in this case, the voltage may have been a little off and uh, it was causing the capture card to be in La La Land and when the USB bus tried to initialize it it wasn't initializing and it just caused Windows to go into that repetitive reboot 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 and not start up so I hope I saved you guys some money from not calling the computer geeks that would charge you an arm and a leg to change a power supply now I can launch Adobe Premiere and edit this video. Thanks for watching. As you can see this program is kind of a beast. It's a big program and my computer is not exactly slow either. This is actually a pretty quick machine that I work with but this program is a monster to load. Alright, now I can edit this program. We'll catch you in the next one.